What's up, car enthusiasts? Today we're taking a look at Audi's latest beast, the 2025 RSQ8 Performance. And let me tell you right off the bat, this might just be the smartest way to spend $137,495 on a super SUV. Yeah, I know that sounds crazy, but stick with me here. Let's start with the headline numbers. 631 horsepower from a twin-turbo V8. That's 40 more horses than the regular RSQ8. And here's the kicker. It's now just 26 horsepower shy of a Lamborghini Urus, while costing about $100,000 less. Let that sink in for a moment. Audi claims this monster will hit 60 in 3.5 seconds, but having tested these cars before, I wouldn't be surprised to see it crack the 3-second barrier in the real world. And it's not just about straight-line speed. The performance model gets a specially tuned air suspension, standard carbon ceramic brakes, and some seriously impressive 48-volt anti-roll tech. Step inside, and it's typical Audi excellence. You can choose between red or gray RS design packages, which add contrast stitching everywhere. There's micro suede on all the touch points, steering wheel, shifter, center console, and you can option even more if you want. The 12.3-inch digital cockpit gets an exclusive shift light indicator in manual mode, which is just cool. Now let's talk about what you can see. Audi's given the RSQ8 a pretty substantial facelift for 2025. Up front, you've got this aggressive new bumper with massive air intakes, and check out this sick new honeycomb grille. Each cell has this cool 3D effect. The performance model gets exclusive matte gray trim on the mirrors, front spoiler, and rear diffuser, but you can option that in carbon fiber or gloss black if you're feeling fancy. But here's what really impresses me, the value proposition. Yes, I know $137,000 is a lot of money, but in the world of super SUVs, it's actually, dare I say it, reasonable? You're getting nearly identical performance to a base Urus, similar tech, arguably better daily usability, and keeping six figures in your pocket. The carbon ceramics alone, 17.3-inch front rotors with 10-piston calipers, would be a five-figure option on most competitors, but they're standard here. One of the coolest features, the lighting. You've got Matrix LED headlights standard with optional laser high beams. But here's the party trick. Both the headlights and the new OLED taillights have five different light signatures to choose from. There's even one that looks like a checkered flag. Pure theater, folks. The wheels deserve their own mention. The standard 22-inch are nice, but the optional 23-inch forged wheels? They're not just for show. They actually cut 44 pounds of unsprung weight. And speaking of weight savings, there's a new exhaust system that's lighter and louder than before. Because who doesn't want more V8 thunder? So, who is this car for? It's for the person who wants all the performance but doesn't need the flash. It's for the enthusiast who appreciates that sometimes the smart choice can also be the fun choice. And most importantly, it's for anyone who's ever looked at a Lamborghini Urus and thought, great car, but do I really need to spend that much? The 2025 Audi RSQ8 performance might just be the thinking person's super SUV. It's got the power, the tech, the luxury, and yes, even some bragging rights of its own. Plus, you can tell everyone at Cars & Coffee that you saved $100,000 by being sensible, even if 631 horsepower is anything but. Let me know in the comments what you think about this German muscle machine. Would you take this over a Urus? And don't forget to like and subscribe for more content like this. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, hit that like button and subscribe for more content just like this. Leave a comment below with your thoughts or questions. I read every single one. And don't forget to click the bell icon to get notified about my next upload. See you in the next video.